So let's say hypothetically there's a young man here who uh, is dating a young woman who tends to lean very far left. Uh, <laughs> do you have any advice for how this young man might uh, go about exposing her to some new ideas without the relationship crashing and burning? Oh, you're an optimist. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so if you're in it for marriage, then the number one thing you must have in common with your spouse is values. You don't have interests come after values. But most people are interested in lots of things. There are lots of interesting things in the world. Liking the same movies, liking the same art, virtually worthless. What is important is that you have the same value system. So politics are a reflection of values. Now, there are a lot of people who never connect their politics with their values. So you have to determine whether she's politically left because this ref represents some core values or just because she's been told a bunch of slogans and now she repeats all these slogans. The question is whether your, your girlfriend's politics or this unnamed person's girlfriend's politics uh, are... <laughs> are a floating bit of flotsam on the top of the ocean or whether there's actually a structural underpinning for, for what she's thinking.